How y'all doing? It's your boy Perplex and Reaper Cortex Reviews. Yeah, I'm back. It's been nine months, bro. Damn time be flying. I'm going to explain. I have an explanation. Your boy Perplex has been going through a lot. A whole lot. I recently changed careers again. Uh, we moved to a different location. Man, your boy been going through a lot of stress, a lot of things. I mean, my job, let's talk about my job. My personal job, dude. 12 hours a day, traveling 35 to 40 minutes or 40 miles out the way every day, rain, sleet, or snow. Because I live in the Michigan area, man, so we have to do a lot of traveling and in the bad weather. And, dude, that took a toll on your dude's mind and body. You know, your mind and body is one. And so the struggle, unfortunately, is my channel. And that's a disservice to you guys. I truly apologize, man. But your boy is back to some form of normality with my schedule and my life. So, man, thank God for that, dude. I'm, I'm able to get back to making my videos and doing things that I love to do. And that's acting the fool on this camera for y'all. How y'all been? Listen, with that being said, your boy Perplex is going to be tuning in multiple times throughout the week. It may not be every day, but it's going to be multiple times throughout the week. You can count on that. Now, let's continue on. Let's talk about some tech talk. How do a brother get a switch OLED? How do a brother get a switch OLED? According to multiple sources, dude, we're going to be able to get some OLEDs, man. Come this uh, Black Friday. I almost say holiday. Black Friday pretty much is a holiday. Man, we can get some, oh man, listen, a lot of people up there like, man, no, I'll pass, I'll wait for the Switch Pro. Man, a Switch Pro may never come out. All of it is just pure speculation right now. People are digging for little stuff, man, here and there, trying to get little intel on what the Switch Pro is, when it's going to come out, what's going to be the specs. Man, we've been doing that for three years now. Dude, the, the OLED is where it's at besides. You've seen the reports about that dock that comes with the Switch Pro, the, the OLED. The dock has some internal capabilities in it that can push out 4K. Yeah, that's what they, that's what they said. Some people broke up on the, the, the dock. They gutted out the dock and they looked at some of the chipsets and the, the um, whatever they have inside the dock. And they said that the dock can actually is capable of upscaling a handheld device to 4K resolution. And that's all I really care about. 60 frames per second, 4K resolution, hey, that's all I care about. And that's going to help the developers out as well because they're going to be able to make games more easier for a system with more, you know, physical or powerful output on the system. You know, so, dude, we have to keep, Nintendo, it's not we, Nintendo have to be able to keep up with what Microsoft and Sony is doing. You know, even Apple trying to creep up in it. Netflix is creeping up with it. You know what I mean? Yeah, I know you guys probably heard that Netflix is doing gaming now. They got a freaking gaming uh, software, the gaming streaming service on mobile devices, on iOS and Android. Yeah, you can stream Netflix games now. You know, it's only on mobile platforms now, but I think, I'm pretty sure by springtime, it'll be on consoles as well. I mean, so Nintendo got to really step the game up, and they have. I've been playing a hell of that Shin Megami Tensei 5, man. That game is dark, it's crazy. A lot of you guys already know my favorite persona. It's three, because it was dark, it was crazy. That Shin Megami Tensei 5 reminds me of that. It's not the same game as Shin Megami Tensei, but it's the same overall landscape, if you guys understand what I'm saying. So I'm hype about that. Y'all need to play that game. If you ain't picked up Shin Megami Tensei, you need to pick that up and play that. Also, according to a source, Microsoft is looking to get into some handheld. Maybe not directly, but from a third party company, according to Yankodesign.com, YD, they saying uh, they got a hand, they got they got a handheld. It's called the uh, Xbox Series A, and they saying this thing is going to be pretty much testing their capabilities on handheld devices such as like the Google Pixel and uh, other powerful phones, and they saying this thing is going to be specifically capable to run Xbox games, and it's going to have a specific Xbox UI on. You know those mobile devices they're going to be having on so i'm pretty sure you're going to have to have a, a, a like i said earlier a state-of-the-art mobile device and they, they're starting off with the pixel and imagine playing halo and gears of war you know and all these dope games man on you know your mobile device you know st strictly with the xbox ui 
on there. And that's what that the website is pretty much talking about. Right now, they're in the infant stages right now. They didn't give us a lot of information, but if you guys want to look more on it, check out yankodesign.com, man, and they're going to give you more intel on it, man. But I'll be hype about that. Competition is good. And we know Nintendo, for the past 30 years, has been dominating the gaming market as far as handheld and pretty much gaming in general. I mean, the gaming market's going to only go as far as Nintendo take them, man. But, dude, man. What y'all think about your boy being back? I'm a little rusty, man. You know, I ain't, I, ain't, I ain't did it in a while, man. But I'm so hype about being back, y'all. I'm so geeked about being back, man. Yeah, I'm still goofy. Hell, I'm still in my 30s. What the hell? You can't you can't lose the goof. You can't lose the goof. Until you didn't get about 50. But me, I'm going to still be wild on that 50. I'm still be goofy at 50. I'm still a gamer, boy. <laughs> anyway, man, I love y'all. Tune in again. It's going to be popular. What is it? It's only Wednesday. I'm gonna probably have about four, five more videos, maybe six more videos by the end of the week. Holla at your boy. I'm happy to be back. I ain't going nowhere. Like I've been going, like I said, I've been going through a lot of stress. I know I said this before, maybe not about personally what I've been going through, but I had to be transparent with you guys now. Anyway, it's your boy Perplex. Cerebral Court Take Reviews. Subscribe. Not subscribe. Tune in. Catch you later.